Hey guys, Ryan here. Today I'll be unboxing the One Piece Sable figure. And this is made by Bandai. And this is for the 20th anniversary of One Piece. So, yeah, that's the front with Sabo. And it looks pretty awesome so far. And then we got the side, we got his backpack. And then we got the back showing different poses of them, basically, different pictures. And then we got Ace, Luffy, and Sabo, so you can get them in this line of figures. So yeah, that's the box, which looks pretty nice. So yeah, I'm gonna get Sabo out of the box, put them together, and then we can look at them in detail. So yeah, let's do that and we can get Sable out of this box. All right, so we got some cardboard. We got his flag. And then, we got Sable here. So yeah, I'm gonna put them together and then we can show them off in detail. So yeah, let's do that. Alright, gonna put the torso and the legs together. There we go. Alright, then we got his head. And he's missing a hand. And I think his hand is attached to the flag. All right, we got the base plate here. So let's get this out. And then we're gonna wanna put this piece here and then we gotta figure out where it goes. All right, so I got Sabo here and I can zoom in. Yeah, he has yellow hair, he has a grin on his face. He has a scar on the right, on his right eye. And which would technically be his left eye. Um, and yeah, he has a white scarf and he has a black coat, dark blue shirt with buttons, silver buttons. And then he has light blue pants, black boots, and he's carrying a red book. He has brown gloves and he's carrying a flag that says ASLL. And that's red, blue, and yellow with a black background with the crossbones. So I don't know what, what that is. Is that like his group of pirates? You guys will have to let me know down in the comments if you know what ASL means. But yeah, this figure's awesome. He's jumping like straight into action. And yeah, he looks really dope. And then if you turn him around, he has a backpack with a little snail phone, sunglasses, a little note. I can zoom in so you can see that better. And then he has some like maps, papers sticking out. So yeah. 
and then just zoom back out. So, yeah, this figure is really nice. He was affordable, looks great, and I'll definitely put him next to my One Piece volume. I'm just showing off a 360 view of Sabo. I don't know too much about Sabo, I've only read One Piece volumes 1 to 70. I know he showed up in One Piece Stampede, the movie, and he has flame powers like Ace. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I wonder how it differs though, because I don't think it's the exact same devil fruit that they ate. It could be, but I don't know. I've never heard of more than one person having uh, one power for two people. I never heard of that, so I don't think that's a thing. But I don't know, I could be wrong. But I'm pretty sure he has different flame powers compared to Ace. And yeah, they're a trio of friends. Luffy, Ace, and Sabo. And yeah, this is kind of spoilers, but so there was an alternate story where Sable saves Ace and Luffy from the Paramount War. So yeah, and I also like how it, he's wearing the straps of his backpack. And his backpack's decent size. I think Luffy should always have a backpack with him from all the treasure that they find on their journey. Makes me think of like Nathan Drake and in the Uncharted series, how, so he didn't have a backpack for the majority of the games, then Uncharted Golden Abyss on a PS Vita, the portable game system, he was wearing a backpack. So, yeah, it's a good thing to have if you're a, a pirate looking for treasure. So yeah, this figure is awesome. He has a great smile, and yeah, he has like a flag, holding a book, running, and he looks awesome. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks so much for watching. And until next time, peace.